Wow, look at you. Pardon me? I don't mean to be forward, sir, but you walk like a movie star. Oh, come on. No, I mean it. I crossed the street, and I caught sight of you walking in profile. I thought I was watching a Johnny Depp movie. Right. Denzel Washington, Jude Law, or somebody. Oh, come on now. I know I've got a pretty cool walk, but uh, I'm no Denzel Washington. Have you ever seen yourself walking in profile in a full-length mirror? Well, no. There you go. I tell you, it's striking. Really? No one's ever said that to me before. Well, I guess you haven't been paying attention. My name's Chet. Hi, Chet. I'm Darlene. I find myself attracted to you, Darlene. I thought you might. Listen, I know I'm moving pretty quickly here, Chet. But when I see something I like, I don't believe in waiting around. So I was I was just going to ask you, would you like to get a room together? Well, sure. That sounds like it could be fun. Okay. Let's go up here to the Paramore. It, it looks pretty nice. All righty. It doesn't strike you as a little odd, Chet. Me inviting you to a hotel two minutes after meeting you? Well, for some guys, I'm sure it would be a little strange. But when I saw how you picked up on my vibe... <laughs> Your Denzel Washington vibe? Yeah, that's it. I knew we were on the same wavelength. Right. Like we're in tune with the same astral harmonic flow? Exactly. Do you know what astral harmonic flow is? Not really. Then why did you say exactly? I don't know. You've got me all discombobulated, I think. You're very excited to be with me, aren't you, Chet? Absolutely. Man, this is gonna... I can't wait. You are a fun girl. Oh, I'm a blast. You're gonna make me wait, aren't you, Darlene? Yes, just a little bit longer. I thought we could enjoy some wine and chat a while. Do you mind... Not only do I not mind, but I find each moment I spend with you even more enticing than the last. Aw, oh, that's sweet. Darlene? Go on, Chet. Say it. I think I love you. Really? It's like you're the woman I've been waiting for my whole life. Like your life was always missing something and I'm the something? I'm the missing piece? That's it. Hold on, Chet. I want to get a good look at your face when I tell you that I care nothing about you at all. You're a fool. I said that movie star stuff to make you look like an ass. And boy, did you look like a great big red ripe one. Darlene. I am not surprised you instantly invited me to bed. You picked up on the Denzel Washington vibe. What an idiot. You horrible, deceitful bitch. Oh, and one more thing. Ah! No. That was a genuine U.S. Women's Olympic Team practice javelin I just impaled you with. Uh, why? Well, I didn't have a knife or a sword or anything. No. Why did you do this to me? Because I hate men, and you're a man. I'm, I'm going to kill you. You sure? I'm thinking it's going to be you that dies. There you go. <coughs>